Hey, how's it going? It's Carl, aka Carl Jump Tack. I'm here right now on a hike. I forgot the name of the hike, uh, but it's a uh, it's an 11 mile hike uh, to go all the way and. Through, uh, as you can see behind me, the Nepali coast, the famous uh, Nepali coast here of Kauai, and um, you know, I just. Uh it's all about you know pushing your comfort zones. You know I, I don't usually do hikes, and uh, this is just about the uh, half mile point. And uh, but it's our last day here in Kauai, so I just wanted to do one last thing before we leave, and uh, you know head on home. So we don't really have a lot of time to do an 11 mile, mile hike, but hopefully when we come back next time. It'll be awesome. Uh, so today, what I want to talk about is um, you know like higher motivation versus lower motivation for marching band and drumline and things like that. So um, what I'm talking about that is that. You know, your lower motivation is something that kind of gets you going to do, uh, you know, what you need to do uh, to get better, right? So, like, for example, you know, a lower motivation, for example, would be like, you know, if you're practicing drums to, like, maybe, like, show up your friends or to prove something to somebody else, right? Somebody says, you know, oh, you, you know, you can't make, you know, a drum core or, you know, you can't make a certain instrument in your drum line or, you know, just uh, people making fun of you for, you know, just uh, not achieving something and then you, it pushes you to achieve more because, you know, it's like you want to prove those people wrong, right? To me, that's like a lower motivation, right? It's like, you know, when I first, first started getting into the fitness thing and, uh, you know, like even doing something like hikes, it's like I got made fun of by my friends you know, in terms of just like, hey, like, you know, you, you suck at like, you know, like the outdoor activities, um, you know, you're not uh, very adventurous enough or you're not strong enough, right? And that's what motivated me to uh, get better with fitness. Um, I used to get made fun of too for playing, you know, in terms of like my basketball skills. So like I wanted to improve my basketball skills um, because that was my motivation, right? It's like I wanted to prove my friends wrong. I wanted to shut them up. And, uh, you know, that's what drove me to get better, right? And I think that's a great motivation, motivating factor and I think it's great to get you started. But I think that in some ways it's like, you know, for me, what I found was that when I finally re reached that goal, it was like, okay, now what, right? It's like, uh, my friends did stop talking, you know, they stopped making fun of me and it's like, all right, now what do I do, right? It's like, do I keep going? Do I keep pushing myself? How do I keep pushing myself if I don't have that motivation, right? So that's why I think that's like a lower form of motivation. I think the higher form of motivation is what you want to get at, right? So whether it's, you know, whatever it is that you're trying to do, whether it's, you know, drumming, marching band, art, fitness, whatever, you know, it's like, when you when you keep doing it right it's like especially like you know the fitness thing you keep doing it just to keep doing it and uh, you know you find the beauty in the act itself and that is the uh, higher motivation it's like you know here I am on this hike um, you know I'm not trying to prove anybody wrong I'm not trying to prove anything to myself or anything like that it's just you know I like doing it and it's just like it's it's really awesome to do it and you know have that feeling of just being out here and uh, you know even like you know when you're doing the fit fitness thing right fit, fitness thing it's like you're working out and then you're enjoying the act itself you're enjoying every rep you're enjoying the pain you're enjoying the sweat you, you enjoy just going to the gym every single day or every other day <laughs> whatever the case may be and it's just a part of you it's who you are there's no other motivation other than you enjoy the act itself so that can go with marching band drum line you know, practicing your instrument, you know, practicing how to play drums, you know, learning new new rudiments, pushing yourself, um, you know, lear learning new licks. It's like that is the higher motivation. It's like, you know, you love doing it just for the sake of doing it. There's no other purpose. There's no other reason. You know, yeah, you could be trying to make a drum line or a drum chord or something, stuff like that. But I have a student right now who's a real estate agent and, you know, he's obviously not going to join marching band or drum corps or anything like that. But, you know, it's what he told me was like, it's on his bucket list. Like he just wanted to learn how to play drums and just for the sake of doing it before, you know, before it's all done. Right. So um, that is that is an example of higher motivation. It's just like for him, it's just, you know, the act itself, the act of like practicing, getting better at something, improving uh, and in some ways learning about yourself in the uh, activity itself. So um, that is what I want you to go for is that higher motivation. Like I said, the lower motivation gets you started. It's a good thing in terms of just like getting you going and uh, you know, it's a good starting point. But for the most part, what you eventually want to get to is that higher motivation. All right. So uh, that is what I wish for you uh, in your journey in whatever uh, activity you choose to do, whether that's marching band, drumline, color guard, uh, fitness, 
um, you know, being a cook. I don't know, right? It's like you, you could be anything. And just remember that what you're trying to get to is the enjoyment of the act itself, all right? So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the view behind me. And uh, if you guys like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you have any questions or comments or uh, if you have a topic that you would like to, s to hear me cover, uh, make sure you leave that as well in the comments below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what the heck are you waiting for? Make sure you subscribe, do it right now, press that button, and uh, I would really appreciate it if you guys did that. And if you already did, I really appreciate you for doing that. So, um, and if you feel like a friend or somebody you know could really benefit from this video, make sure you share this video on all your social media, on all your social media platforms, and I would really appreciate that as well, all right? So, cool, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, uh, peace out. I'll see you guys next time. From Kauai, signing out, mahalo.